In this video, we will add the needed API requests to register and login in Firebase. Please check the previous video on how to create your Firebase project, in case you haven't already done so. Firebase uses Identity Toolkit of Google API, so the server URL is the same for every Firebase project. You can find the server URL for the Firebase Authentication API in the description of this video, or Google's documentation. Let's create our first request. We will call it Register User. Again, you will need to copy the path from the video description. This is also a post request. We can select it using the tab above. Then, we need to add a query parameter called key. This is to identify our project in Google systems. We also need to add an email and a password text parameter in the body. Finally, a return secure token, which is a type of boolean, should be sent to the server, according to the documentation. For the responses, we will add a success response, which has HTTP status code 200. We can assign whatever function name we want, but usually we use something that will remind us of what this response is about. Finally, it returns us an ID token parameter. Don't worry if you don't understand all these. Usually, you just copy from the respective documentation. Similarly, we are going to create the login user request. Again, we set up the path and select the post HTTP method. Also, we need to add the parameters like we did previously. For the response, we have a success 1, so its status code is 200. This one will return us the email, the local ID of our logged in user, and an ID token. 